Welcome to Democracy Now!, democracynow.org, The War and Peace Report. I'm Amy Goodman. Tens of thousands rallied on Washington's National Mall Sunday for what organizers dubbed the largest climate rally in U.S. history. The Forward on Climate event urged President Obama to reject the Keystone XL oil pipeline and accept binding limits on emissions of carbon. Indigenous leader Chief Jacqueline Thomas and Casey Camps said the Keystone XL pipeline endangers their communities. It puts at risk my neighbors to the east of me that live at the tar sands. The government doesn't recognize these people, and these people have been dying of mysterious cancers. Their water is polluted, their animals are sick, and Mother Earth is sick. And we're here to make a difference. We're here to be in solidarity with all of us who understand that we have a very slim opportunity to make human life continue to exist, and, and that's, that's our choice. Groups opposing coal production, nuclear power and hydraulic fracturing for natural gas participated in the protest, as did a number of interfaith organizations. Several smaller parallel rallies were held in cities across the country. We'll have more on the forward on climate rally after headlines. Thanks so much for watching this report from Democracy Now!, your daily independent global news hour. We don't accept advertising or corporate funding, but rather rely on donations from viewers like you. Please make your contribution by visiting democracynow.org. We need your support today to keep bringing you this hard-hitting, in-depth reporting.